द वे फॉर्वर्ड इज थोड़ा बहुत बहुत स्वागत है मैं थोड़ा होस्ट हरजोत सिंह इस वेले इलेक्शंस का सीजन चलता पे है और असी टाइम टू टाइम थोड़े सामने साड़ी कम्युनिटी के जोड़े कैंडीडेट्स हैं जो कि वेरियस पॉलिटिकल पोजिशन वास्ते रन करते पे इस नवंबर में उन्होंने तोड़े सामने लैके आते हैं तोड़े न रूबरू कराते हैं अज सा को एक बड़ी इंप्रेसिव लिस्ट हैगी है कैंडीडेट्स की और सब तो पहले जिन कैंडीडेट नाल असी गल करा वो एक वेल नोन फिगर है बे एरिया दे बड़े एक्टिव सोशल वर्कर एंटरप्रनोर अ ट्रस्टड लीडर इन द सिख एंड वाइडर साउथ एशियन कम्यूनिटी मिस हरबीर कौर भाटिया हरबीर जी अपने कम्यूनिटी मैंबर्स टू बी पार्ट ऑफ द पोलिटिकल प्रोसेस इन दिस कंट्री टू वोट एंड यू नो टू रन फॉर ऑफिस बट वी had a call last week we interviewed some uh, candidate for a position and uh, there was somebody from a community who says ki bhai politicians our political leaders play a very important role in creating uh, a society we agree with that right and said appa inna tu bhaj ke te itthe aaya is navi society vich so why should we bring our own people back to sit over our heads how, how do you respond to that well first of all i'm really glad to be here so thank you for giving the opportunity uh, and your question is such a very important question hai ga ji uh ek cheez hai ki jadon assi jithon vi aaye assi koi vi immigrant aanda hai oh koi मकसद ले आता है यह है कि मैं अपने बच्चों का ख्याल रखूंगा रखूंगी आई विल गैट अ बेटर जॉब आई विल बी एबल टू प्रैक्टिस सिखी फ्रीली और एनी थिंग टू बी एनी रिलीजन फ्रीली वो चीज़ा जो असी अपने देश में छोड़ के आते हैं इस देश आने लिए असी उस चीज़ से ज़्यादा फोकस करते हैं पर होंगे कि जब असी इतने आके एस्टैबलिश हो चुके हैं असी भूल जाते हैं कि जो इतने की पॉलिसीज ने उन्होंने policies to see shape karna hai and what i mean by that is that we're not meant to be on the sidelines mm. just because we came to america for a better purpose or better reason for, than what we had it wasn't pe- people didn't leave like you said the countries to come here and be politicians right mm-hmm. you came here because you were trying to make something better of your life but what is part of making your better life a better life is making sure the place you live in can include you can consider your perspectives that it suits your needs mm-hmm. but to do that we have to be involved in shaping that future and that shaping of the future comes with policy making mm. and that's why it's so critical for our people to be in part and in the in the conversation of how do we shape the future of not just where we live in our little town but in the whole country mm. and six come on we let's accept it we are uh, we are from a uh, gurus and the the children of gurus who fought oppression who fought for better society for all sarbata pula ei matlab hai ga right ki assi sab da khayal rakhe assi sab nu upar karange to oh cheez hai sari basic value hai ki hai oh to har taraf har jagah assi laga sakde ha aur itthe aake it's most important jab jab assi sochde ha ki is culture di ki ki foundation hai ki hai it's a declaration of independence mm. oh shuru kar diya we the people mm. the we part is who we are six we is what makes us part of the whole fabric the we is what we believe in in sikhi it is never about me mm. because we is what make, makes vaigru all together we equal vaigru vaigru is us mm-hmm. so if we're going to take care of vaigru we better take care of each other so if a person wants to look at it in a practical sense mm-hmm. or they want to look at it from a spiritual perspective mm-hmm. it is our responsibility to uplift the, the community mm-hmm. and there's a popular saying in america if you uh, don't have a seat on the table you're on the menu isn't that right 
<laughs> Absolutely right. If we don't have a voice, mm -hmm. we are going to become the food. <laughs> so, yes. As we have viewers know that there are many salam of history hai hai, Harbir Ji di, serving the community. Uh, presently, she serves on multiple local and national boards on community building, diversity and inclusion, economic development, women's rights, education, public safety. She is Cultural Commissioner for Santa Clara, Board Member of the SV Central Chamber of Commerce, and Board of the SC Libraries Foundation and Friends, Deputy Board Member for Joint Venture Silicon Valley. Uh, that's, that's very impressive. We thank you for your service, Arbirji. Sanu, uh, please, the Soki Hun is position of the state to you're running for uh, city council of Santa Clara. W what's the motivation behind that? That's it starts with what you asked me in the beginning. Mm -hmm. You know, I have been doing community organizing since I was a child. When we came to US, it was that ki apni seva karange just to be part of the community. But we never thought about it as you're supposed to or in the leadership. So mm -hmm. As any other family comes, right? But now, Sadi family, Papa is Sanu Sikhaisi, Mami is Sikhaisi, doing seva helps you also be uplifting the community, but becoming part of the community. Mm -hmm. But it never meant that I was supposed to become a leader of the community because I never thought people like me that look like me are supposed to be people that are supposed to lead because I used to think I'm the outsider. Mm -hmm. Not that this is my country also. Mm. So this is where I come and say that revelation has come more and more, I would say, um, been strengthened in the last few years. People used to call me by my nickname of Senator Kaur. Mm -hmm. I used to laugh. I said, oh, what the heck? I'm Senator Kaur. I'm not the mm -hmm. technology or innovation. But then it slowly started becoming clearer that the problem is mm -hmm. we need people like us mm -hmm. because we are the voices of a different perspective voices of a different heritage that is strengthened by this heritage and together i realized i can actually help implement policies that are lacking and that is the challenge we're having and i'll tell you something our our city is 67 65 percent minority mm. that's huge mm -hmm. that's one of the largest um um you know the cities in the area with such a diverse population mm -hmm. but guess what Mm -hmm. There has never been a diverse member on the on the council mm -hmm. since 1950. Wow, that's that's mind-boggling. Gee, Harbiji, I I think uh, there's something which we notice in uh, our community particularly. What we see is that when the presidential election is, there's a lot of fervor, there's a lot of excitement, mm -hmm. hai, but people still don't give that much value to these local elections, uh, the city board election, the city council, the mayor election. Oh, Sanu, a little bit of views. Nu daso, why is it so important to participate in these elections? That's a great question. I think this is a very important one for our public, mm -hmm. especially our people. So, asi pul jaane ki jo national politics banji hum dene na, wo local to hi shuru hon dene. Just na aaj ye aaj ka Black Lives Matter di kala sun rahe right? Mm -hmm. Problems with the fire and, and the climate change. Mm -hmm. All these things are because of bad policies at the city level. Mm -hmm. If city level made better policies to ensure that the whole society is considered when making decisions, mm -hmm. that we give the voices to all of those that are underrepresented, and underrepresented are people like us. But it's our responsibility to stand up for those minority voices. Mm -hmm. So when I tell our people why you must vote, mm -hmm. is because that's your power. How do citizen the like um, the the power uh, power is through the vote. Har citizen to vote karna chahiye tha. Oh, sab to important cheez hai ki hai. Aaj kal jo asi dekh rahe national politics se kyu hua hai is tarah? Because saare log tarah log baithi rande ne kya rande ne saare nu ki fikr hai kya? Oh, to apne aap hi jo hote ho rahe hoi jayega apne aap hi. But if we didn't, if we had taken part and said no, no, this is not a good person to be putting into power or giving the responsibility to be representative or make policies for us. Mm -hmm. We wouldn't be having problems like we do that have now become the problem across the country. Mm -hmm. But if if my city had thought about, example I will give you, is affordable housing for people from youth to seniors to low income, why would there would be so many homeless 
there mm -hmm. wouldn't be so many homeless if I had thought about building affordable housing. Mm -hmm. See, that's a local issue. Yeah. But in, uh, when we stop remembering we have the power to solve it here, mm -hmm. it starts to get bigger and bigger and bigger, mm -hmm. and then it starts to become a regional and a national problem. Yeah. And that's where our people have to get involved. They must use their voice for the vote. Harbir ji, asi tode candidature nu jede sare viewers and unade naal zada relatable bana saki or samjhen ki apna kis position aste lad rahe hain or you know what are we talking about? To shi sanu dasogi ki kere areas han jo tode is particular jede constituency or the under amden and what are the areas of work that get affected by what you do on city council? Oh, very good question. Thank you for giving me the chance to answer that. Sure. The first is quality of life. G. Quality of life, matlab ki hega. Traffic problems, uh, housing the problems, infrastructure the problems, having uh, programming that is relatable to us, right? These mm -hmm. are very simple things. We don't think they're very important, but somebody decided what's okay in those decisions. Mm -hmm. For example, if I was to improve um, if I was to bring in uh, 10,000 more houses down the street, mm -hmm. for example, mm -hmm. that would have severe traffic implications. Mm -hmm. And guess whose life gets ruined? Mm -hmm. People that are living in the area. So quality of life is very big. Mm -hmm. Number two is economic sustainability. Mm -hmm. Many city, $34 million in deficit a year. G. $34 million. Mm -hmm. Or Sunday reserves in number $90 million. Koi bhi math kar sakdai. That is a very bad ratio of reserves to account, um, to money, right? Of mm -hmm. deficit. Mm -hmm. Now, if I don't have that money, we don't have the parks. Mm -hmm. We don't have the uh, clean air, uh, the clean uh, the parks, uh, the clean water. We don't have um, safety. We don't mm -hmm. have public safety. Mm -hmm. We don't have ways to actually ensure that us see jobs kar sakte hain, us see infrastructure bana sakte hain. O paise yahan the bahut zarurat hai ye. But jo saade leaders ne unne kharab dis unne kharab decisions bana rahe hain, apne seat nu rakhen le, unna nu. उन्होंने ऐसा तरह का फ्यूचर बनाया कि सारी सिटी खत्म हो जाएगी। हरबीर जी। So if somebody lives here, they would need to want to keep the city। जी जी जी। आशी तोरनल एक गल जारी रखेंगे एक छोटी जी ब्रेक दे बाद तो उसी वेग देरो the way forward। the way forward is तोड़ा फिर तो स्वागत है मैं तोड़ा होस्ट हरजोत सिंह। आज आशी गल कर रहे हैं सेंटा क्लारा सिटी काउंसिल के कैंडिडेट हरबीर कोर भाटिया चिदाल। हरबीर जी ब्रेक ते जान तो पहले तुष्य सानु कुछ लोकल इश्यूज दे बारे इस दशरे सिगे की होर इश्यूज जो तोड़ी सिटी नू कन्फ्रेंट करते हैं। one is, like I was saying about the housing, we have a huge shortage of housing. California is expecting to be uh, at, uh, I think, 3.5 million new homes mm -hmm. by 2035. Mm -hmm. We're nowhere close to that because there's such a huge shortage. Mm -hmm. So I'm working very, you know, much on bringing local housing projects, but then also we bring mixed use, it means we bring in commercial and retail mm -hmm. and little mini destinations and each new housing project to make sure that we keep people in the project, mm -hmm. not to have to walk very far, to have things to do for their families, enjoy parks. And then finally, a big one for me actually is local representation. Mm -hmm. Our community is not involved at all. Mm -hmm. And I really want to involve them. Yeah. How does one do that? We have boards, we have commissions. Mm -hmm. It's really important for me to we to give minority voices, like our own South Asian community, our Sikh community, mm -hmm. chances to be on boards and commissions so they can start influencing policy without having to be elected. And that's called being an appointed commissioner, mm -hmm. as I am today. Sure. That's a great way for them getting practice to become future council members. Mm -hmm. So we must start engaging our people to become part of the boards and commissions. Mm -hmm. uh, Harbir ji, uh, as, as you said, the local issues and they have uh, you know national implications. Ek cheez jee isle bada ek challenge sare samne aare hai. And you know President Trump has you know made a whole campaign out of it is safety. And uh, there are people who feel uh, nervous with uh, slogans like defund the police because uh, some people say uh, uh, there's not a clear understanding of what that means. Where do you stand on that? So here's the thing. Yeah. Uh, I think we have enough data points to show us that there is definitely a need for some change. Mm -hmm. Now, can a, can a society turn on and off and become uh, having a need for no criminal justice system overnight? It cannot. 
So as I've talked to many people in the police force and friends that are against having a police force altogether, I realize they're asking for similar things, mm -hmm. that we need change, we need improvement. We need to increase the education mm -hmm. of our police force. We have such diverse communities. We have mental health issues. We have um, racial issues. And we also have uh, abusive power issues. But we need to educate and improve the training programs that our law enforcement has to be able to know how to handle those situations differently. Mm -hmm. We don't always need a, a, a gunned police, um, a law enforcement. Sometimes you may need more of a social worker. Mm -hmm. Do you need, do we think homelessness requires a policeman? It doesn't. But what we do is we use misuse the people that we have into situations where they're not needed. And then where we need people, we don't have enough resources for. So when I was asked this question by our police officers association, mm -hmm. well, what are my thoughts on this? Mm -hmm. I said, we have to keep our essential services. Mm -hmm. That includes law enforcement and also includes our fire and safety. Mm -hmm. However, that does not mean that we keep it the way it is. It needs drastic change. Uh, for example, in Norway and Sweden, mm -hmm. they have three years of education before they're allowed to have a gun in, at, at, on, their, on, their, um, on the force. We need programs that use other forms of de-escalation before, before turning to guns. Mm -hmm. So that's just an example of the type of changes we need to consider. So, so instead of uh, defunding the police, you're saying we should give them more funds for additional training? And other I would say we need to reform the models to re reuse the funds they have mm -hmm. to do invest more in education and training. Sure. Uh, you know, uh, with, with this COVID-19 situation, I think uh, the local governments, the local, uh, at, at the basic local level, there has to be support from the government. Yes. Uh, what, what, what do you plan to do if you're on the city council? So that's a great question. So actually, I'll give you first an example of what I did do. Mm -hmm. When COVID hit, the first week of March, we were, we were told to go into shelter in place. Gee. Instead of myself hunkering down, mm -hmm. of course, as a Sikhni, our job is to get out there and make change. Gee. I launched a coalition in which 550 volunteers joined to make face masks mm -hmm. because there were no face masks coming from China and the other countries. We made 40,000 masks with 550 volunteers. Mm -hmm. Huge impact we have on the society. Gee. Second, I actually made a uh, face shield with a friend of mine. We mm -hmm. prototyped it and took it to Kaiser CEO and asked him to approve it. Gee. We tweaked the design, we hired a workforce, we built an assembly line by converting a local uh, local uh, manufacturing site mm -hmm. into, actually it's a soccer site, into a manufacturing site, mm -hmm. and we started churning out assembly line uh, face shields. If we're going to continue this, we cannot be sitting on the sidelines. We have to come up with solutions. If I could do it as a single person in the community, imagine what we can do as a council. First is we must give our small businesses um, uh, fee waivers and lien uh, waivers that allow them to have permits to work outside or inside based on the pandemic situation. Mm -hmm. Number two, we need to come up with new creative business models mm -hmm. that allow us to allow our small businesses to exist. Mm -hmm. Number three, we need to come up with an education system or at least provide the resources so the education systems can allow the children to get to school and have daycare in a more uh, physically distanced location. For example, we have huge parks. We should convert them into outdoor play areas or outdoor daycare centers so families can go to work. Now, these are just a few examples of the kind of things that we need to do. But what matters the most is we work with the public to find solutions, not wait for the federal government to find solutions. Mm -hmm. That's the most important thing. Ji. And, and Harbir ji, uh, national level, we are so divided right now. Uh, but I guess at the local level, we should uh, come together. And how do you, uh, as a member of the city council, plan to bring people together at the local level? That's a, that's a real challenge today as it is. I think everybody's very divided. Mm -hmm. But let's look at why we're divided. Mm -hmm. We don't agree upon the, we don't disagree upon the fact that we all want something better and we want to start the economy, but we also want to start safe. Mm -hmm. I think if you look at the common goals and focus on that goal versus the fact that we are voting for somebody different or we have a different um, approach, mm -hmm. that is the best way to build a bridge. Looking mm -hmm. at the common goal and common outcome versus what divides us. Because honestly, more unites us than it divides us Gee. and that is safety opportunities feeling appreciated 
having a quality of life. When we can focus on those things, we actually look past our divisions. Indeed. And Trump did help us by, by the fact that he got elected. Mm -hmm. What did he tell us? There were a group of people that have been looked over for too many years. Mm -hmm. I don't look at it. He's not the problem. He's a symptom of the problem. Mm -hmm. As much as I dislike him, the point is somehow there's a group of people that feel that their needs were not being met. Mm -hmm. We need to focus on those needs mm -hmm. and how do we solve for those needs versus the fact, do we like Trump or not? Mm -hmm. uh, Harbir ji, I would like you to tell our viewers your unique experience and the skills that you bring that will make uh, you the best candidate for this position you're seeking. Well, we're not taught to talk about ourselves that way or see ourselves that way, but I can just tell you, Ji. we need to rethink how we live, the way Ji. we work, mm -hmm. uh, play, mm -hmm. how do we take care of our families, mm -hmm. and learn. Ji. And that requires a different type of thinking. Mm -hmm. And I believe the future requires people that are very innovative, mm -hmm. who have management experience, mm -hmm. who are really committed to the public's benefit, mm -hmm. not to the personal benefit. Mm -hmm. And my background as a technologist, as an entrepreneur, mm -hmm. I've also been a marketeer, I've been in media, but more than that, I've always been a community organizer. Mm -hmm. And those, I think, unique combinations mm -hmm. would give me the edge above my, my competition. And I believe we can do great things together with the community to make a very um, successful and a thriving community for everyone. Mm -hmm. Arbiji, what's the message for the community here? Your vo voice is powerful and it is impactful through the vote. Mm -hmm. You must participate. Please mm -hmm. do not think you are just one person and you don't have uh, ability to make change. Actually, your, your vote is the greatest thing that you could do right now to help us choose better leaders mm -hmm. who think about the whole public and not their personal agendas. Mm -hmm. Very well said, Harbirji. We thank you so much for taking out the time, coming and speaking with our viewers. Asan Harbir Bhatia ji, asi unhane saanu jadi local election hai, and she particularly emphasised ki sab tu zoruri jadi election tode lai hai, o tode local election hai. Is country nu design hi the ek kita gaya hai ki federal government baad hi chandi hai, pehla sab tu tode jadi local government hai gaya hai. लोकल फंडिंग है ये हरबीर जी थैंक यू वेरी मच आज यू होप करते हैं कि यू विल कम अगेन एंड स्पीक विद द व्यूअर्स एट ग्रेटर लेंथ थैंक यू सो मच फॉर कमिंग थैंक यू सो मच वेरी राखा चंगा तो सी वेक देरो द वे फॉरवर्ड द वे फॉरवर्ड इज थोड़ा फिर तो स्वागत है मैं थोड़ा होस्ट हरजोत सिंह जिन कैंडीडेट नाल असी हूँ गल कर लगे हाँ वो हैं जतेंद्र पाल कोट साही जी जो कि न्यू हेवन यूनिफाइड स्कूल डिस्ट्रिक्ट स्कूल बोर्ड वस्ते कैंडीडेट है फॉर एरिया वन जतेंद्र पाल कौर जी थोड़ा बहुत बहुत स्वागत है थैंक यू हरजोत जी असी अपने व्यूअर्स में दस दिए कि साढ़े को एक बड़ी इम्प्रेसिव लिस्ट ऑफ कैंडिडेट्स है आज जतेंद्र पाल जी शी इज़ मैस्टर इन हेल्थ केयर एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन एंड एन एम बी ए इन ऑपरेशन मैनेजमेंट ओ सी ई ओ है रोटरी केयर बे एरिया फ्री मेडिकल कैंप्स चला दिन विच हैव सम टेन locations uh, in california is that right jatinder pal ji haan ji we serve the uninsured uh, individuals within the state of california san francisco bay area to be specific ji 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 uh in other senior management and executive level uh, experience hai ga bahut sara bahut sari non uh, profit uh, organizations which ek uh, bada jazba uh, successful uh, in other career hai ga uh, social uh, work which uh jatinder pal ji sanu dasso kin wajah de karan tusi is position layi election lad rahe ho what motivates you Yeah, so I have a daughter who's in fourth grade in the school district. Ji. And 2009, the, uh, 19, the which his strike was easy. Ji. So the strike of 2019, it affected uh, parents, childrens, and teachers. Mm -hmm. So at that time, concerns of the teachers were raised. Mm -hmm. Concerns of the district employees was raised. Mm -hmm. But the voice of the parent was left out. 
So there was so much misinformation Mm -hmm. and parents were also feeling affected along with the kids. Mm -hmm. So I want to be a voice for the parents and bring their concerns to the table and to bring transparency of information. ਅਸੀਂ ਆਪਣੇ ਵਿਊਅਰਸ ਨੂੰ ਦੱਸ ਦਈਏ ਕਿ ਜਤਿੰਦਰ ਪਾਲ ਜੀ ਇਜ਼ ਅ ਫਾਊਂਡਿੰਗ ਮੈਂਬਰ ਆਫ ਅ ਪੇਰੈਂਟ ਐਡਵਾਈਜ਼ਰੀ ਗਰੁੱਪ ਐਟ ਨਿਊ ਹੇਵਨ ਸਕੂਲ ਡਿਸਟ੍ਰਿਕਟ ਇਜ਼ ਦੈਟ ਰਾਈਟ ਜਤਿੰਦਰ ਪਾਲ ਜੀ ਹਾਂ ਜੀ ਥੈਟ ਵਾਸ ਸਮਥਿੰਗ ਥੈਟ ਆਈ ਸਟਾਰਟਡ ਇਨ 2019 ਇਥੇ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਪੋਪੂਲੇਸ਼ਨ ਕਾਫੀ ਹੈਗੀ ਆ ਜੀ ਐਂਡ ਵਿਦ ਥੈਟ ਟੀਚਿੰਗ ਦੀ ਪੇਰੈਂਟਸ ਹਾਊ ਟੂ ਮਨੂਵਰ ਥਰੂ ਦਿਸ ਸਿਸਟਮ ਐਂਡ ਲਰਨਿੰਗ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਦਿਸ ਸਕੂਲ ਸਿਸਟਮ ਇਟਸ ਵੈਰੀ ਡਿਫਰੈਂਟ ਹੀਅਰ ਥੈਨ ਇਟ ਇਜ਼ ਇਨ ਇੰਡੀਆ ਹਮ ਹਮ ਜਤਿੰਦਰ ਪਾਲ ਜੀ ਅਸੀਂ ਵੇਖਦੇ ਆ ਅੱਜ ਅਸੀਂ ਆਪਣੇ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਜੋ ਕੈਂਡੀਡੇਟਸ ਹਨ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਸਾਹਮਣੇ ਲੈ ਕੇ ਆ ਰਹੇ ਆ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਆਪਣੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਰੂਬਰੂ ਕਰਾਉਂਦੇ ਆ ਤੇ ਕਾਫੀ ਵਿਮਨ ਕੈਂਡੀਡੇਟਸ ਸਾਹਮਣੇ ਆ ਰਹੇ ਹਨ ਔਰ ਬੜੇ ਇੰਪ੍ਰੈਸਿਵ ਕੈਂਡੀਡੇਟਸ ਬਟ ਕਿਆ ਸਾਡੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਵਿੱਚ ਹਾਲੀ ਵੀ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਕੋਈ ਥੋੜਾ ਚੈਲੰਜ ਨਜ਼ਰ ਆਂਦਾ ਹੈ ਐਸ ਐਸ ਵਿਮਨ ਟੂ ਰਨ ਫॉर ਥੀਸ ਪੋਜੀਸ਼ਨਸ I think it's a part of being in the Sikh religion ke see there is always going to be pushback ke the role of the female is not outside of the home but we need to push through those barriers ji sikhi hai jede vich equality ditti hoyi hai for both men and women ji and we should be able to accomplish anything that a male can and i think you know 2020 we're here mm-hmm. and let's make a change this year ji 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 you know as i uh, as i said ki as candidates no samne leke aande hain and we have come across some very impressive uh, candidates uh, you being one of them sanu ਸੋਗੇ ਕਿ ਕੀ ਇਸ਼ੂਸ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਲੱਗਦੇ ਹਨ ਜੋ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਇਸ ਬੋਰਡ ਨੂੰ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਇਸ ਡਿਸਟ੍ਰਿਕਟ ਨੂੰ ਕਨਫਰੰਟ ਕਰ ਰਹੇ ਹਨ ਔਰ ਕੀ ਹਾਊ ਡੂ ਯੂ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਪਲਾਨ ਟੂ ਟੈਕਲ ਥੈਮ ਯਾ ਸੋ ਆਈ ਹੈਵ 3 ਪ੍ਰਾਇੋਰਟੀਜ਼ ਪਹਿਲੀ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਇਨਵੈਸਟਿੰਗ ਇਨ ਟੀਚਰਸ ਇਜ਼ ਇਨਵੈਸਟਿੰਗ ਇਨ ਆਰ ਚਿਲਡਰਨ ਸੋ ਦ ਟੀਚਰਸ ਆਰ ਦ ਬੈਕਬੋਨ ਆਫ ਆਰ ਚਾਈਲਡਸ ਐਜੂਕੇਸ਼ਨ ਦੇ ਸਪੈਂਡ ਮੋਰ ਟਾਈਮ ਵਿਦ ਥੈਮ ਥੈਨ ਦੇ ਮੇ ਵਿਦ ਅਸ ਐਟ ਹੋਮ ਸੋ ਵਿਦ ਕੋਵਿਡ-19 ਐਂਡ ਡਿਸਟੈਂਸ ਲਰਨਿੰਗ ਵੀ ਨੀਡ ਟੂ ਮੇਕ ਸ਼ੂਰ ਥੈਟ ਦੇ ਹੈਵ ਆਲ ਦ ਰਿਸੋਰਸਿਸ ਅਵੇਲੇਬਲ ਜੀ but in addition to that we need high quality teachers mm-hmm. so what are school districts especially our school district what are they doing to retain those those teachers mm-hmm. and we need to start thinking outside the box what are some incentives that are working and ones that are not working mm-hmm. uh, that includes financial incentives workplace incentives uh, local school districts in their area san jose santa clara they're um approving housing for their teachers and that includes using unused school sites Gee. so why can't new haven which is right you know we're in the heart of silicon valley san francisco bay area why can't we be innovative and use some of these out of the box ideas to provide more for our teachers <laughs> second is uh, promoting educational equity across all school sites g so i want there to be a review of systems i'm running from area 1 area 1 schools Uh, the programs that are offered in area 1 schools vary from the other areas within the school district how can we come to the table review those programs and make sure that the programs that are being offered and this starts from the elementary school level starting from kindergarten what are the programs that are available to those children and make sure it's the same across this entire school system mm-hmm. and the third one is promoting stem or science technology and engineering um in all of our schools uh, to all of our children as early as first grade so new haven unified is unique in that we uh, have the grant race to the top which provided a chromebook for each one of our students so starting in kindergarten each one of our students uses a chromebook and they're taught uh, reading and math uh, through the chromebook mm-hmm. so let's take a step further and start w- teaching them stem starting from first grade mm mm-hmm. ਜਦੋਂ ਦੇ ਪਾਜੀ ਇਹ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਪਾਰਟਿਕੂਲਰਸ ਲੈਸ ਇਹ ਕੋਵਿਡ ਦੀ ਸਿਚੁਏਸ਼ਨ ਦੇਖ ਰਹੇ ਆ ਲੋਟ ਆਫ ਪੀਪਲ ਆਰ ਐਡਵੋਕੇਟਿੰਗ ਕਿ ਬੱਚੇ ਸਕੂਲ ਦੇ ਚਾਨ ਐਂਡ ਲੋਟ ਆਫ ਪੀਪਲ ਆਰ ਟੇਕਿੰਗ ਥਿਸ ਪੋਜੀਸ਼ਨ ਕਿ ਬੱਚੇ ਹਲੀ ਸਕੂਲਸ ਓਪਨ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੋਣੇ ਚਾਹੀਦੇ ਇਟ ਇਟ ਸ਼ੁੱਡ ਬੀ ਮੋਰ ਆਨਲਾਈਨ ਲਰਨਿੰਗ ਵੋ ਵੀ ਡੂ ਯੂ ਸਟੈਂਡ ਓਨ ਥਿਸ 
so uh, as I, my medical clinics were also closed due to COVID-19 and we ran into issues when we're reopening. So there's multiple issues that need to be taken care of. Mm -hmm. uh, first is, do the schools have the proper ventilation system? Mm -hmm. So we here in the Bay Area, not all of our schools had AC. They didn't have the pro proper HVAC systems and they were installed afterwards. So is there proper ventilation? Mm -hmm. um, second is managing students. How do you bring a six-year-old to to a classroom and parents have enough time as it is trying to tell them keep your mask on don't don't touch this don't touch that how can we expect a teacher to do that hmm. um, third is do we have proper sanitizing procedures and equipment for the schools <laughs> And thirdly is, or lastly, we need to follow all the state, CDC, and local guidelines. Um, and we need to have multiple plans. It's it's a multi-layered, complicated situation that we're in, and we need to make sure that we take care of it properly, think it out, and ha think about the best for our local communities. Mm -hmm. Palji, I would ask you, what is unique in, in in your experience which makes you the best candidate for this position? So in addition to running medical clinics and managing a nonprofit, I also have teaching experience. Gee. I've taught at Cal State East Bay. Mm -hmm. um, I've taught online classes. I've taught hybrid classes. I've taught in-person classes. So I understand the challenges that teachers face. Mm -hmm. I'm also a parent. I'm a parent of a child who's in elementary school. So I, I'm understanding the challenges, the differences mm -hmm. across the school district. I, I I think uh, we've had some technical difficulty there. I see, Hanji Jatinder ji, you're back. Can you can you hear me? I'm back. Yeah, yes. So, sorry about that. Hanji, to see the session again. Ji. So I am also a parent. So I'm involved in the schools and I understand the school systems. And I've also been involved at the. Uh, district level um, and understand some of the nuances, some of the successes, and some of the frustrations at the mm. district level. Gee, 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 gee. Uh, I, I think uh, a very uh, valuable experience hai ga, or study community new load hai, to uh, you know uh, people who have uh, experience and you know who have experience for all sides who uh, can take all perspectives, uh, bring all different perspectives to the picture. Uh, uh, message study community like. Uh, as I said before, uh, this is a, a wonderful year for uh, Punjabi Sikh females, and let's conquer any challenges we have, and let's move on. And Palji, I'm sorry. I think uh, we lost you again there. Thank you so much for that message. As you know, completely uh, agree. Kar we, we have seen, um, you know, a lot of uh, women coming forward and conquering whatever they are endeavoring into. We wish you all the very best for your campaign head. Aaj sadna gal karanda bohot bohot shukriya. Asi ithe ek chote ji break langhe, tusi wake dero the way forward. The way forward is tora fir tu swagat hai, main tora host Harjot Singh. Aaj asi todi gal karwa rahe hain apne community de kuch candidates jo ki November vich aan wale elections vich various offices vaste run kar rahe hain sade kol bade impressive candidates samne aaye hain aur hun ek hor young candidate equally impressive Mr Harjeet Singh who's running for Yuba City School Board Harjeet Singh tora bahut bahut swagat hai Harjit, uh, thanks for taking out the time. Sadnal Gal Karanlai. Sanu Harjit, quickly does so ki to see a school board the election lay uh, Lanan Bare Q Socha. G, thank you, G. Pella thought about what thank you. There's Aris Rotsanu, Srotenu Piaka, is a three call. G. Mirana Harjit Singha, Mete, Yuba City, which Rendaha, the Yuba City School Board, the election was the Kadaha. May Ethiapani, Yuba City, which Barmi Tak Padai Kiti. So Puri Apani K through twelve Padai Ethehi Kiti, Ethehi Rezoya, the Ferustobad, May Apna Bachelor's Degree Astrophysics, UC Berkeley Tokiti, the Ferme Master's. And teaching Kiti Jitime high school science teacher Vireha, 
ਤੇ ਹਾਈ ਸਕੂਲ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਪੜਾਇਆ ਵੀ ਤੇ ਉਸ ਤੋਂ ਬਾਅਦ ਮੈਂ ਇੱਥੇ ਯੂਬਾ ਸਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਜਕਾਰਾ ਮੂਵਮੈਂਟ ਸੰਸਥਾ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਆਰਗੇਨਾਈਜ਼ ਕਰ ਰਿਹਾ ਤੇ ਯੂਥ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਕਾਫੀ ਸੰਪਰਕ ਆ ਤੇ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਾਰੇ ਸਟੋਰੀ ਸੁਣਦੇ ਆ ਵੇ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਕਿਹੜੀਆਂ ਮੁਸ਼ਕਲਾਂ ਸਕੂਲ ਵਿੱਚ ਆਉਂਦੀਆਂ ਤੇ ਇਸ ਮੁਸ਼ਕਲਾਂ ਦਾ ਕੁਝ ਹੱਲ ਕਰਨ ਲਈ ਆਪਣੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਨੂੰ ਅੱਗੇ ਤੋਰਨ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਤੇ ਆਪਣੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦੀ ਆਵਾਜ਼ ਬਣਨ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਤੇ ਉੱਥੇ ਡਿਸੀਜਨਸ ਬਣਾਉਣ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਮੈਂ ਸੋਚਿਆ ਵੀ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਵਿੱਚ ਸ਼ਾਮਲ ਹੋਣਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਆ ਤੇ ਇਸ ਕਰਕੇ ਮੈਂ ਇਸ ਰੇਸ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਖੜਾ ਹਾਂ ਜੀ 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 ਅਸੀਂ ਹਰਜੀਤ ਅਸੀਂ ਦੇਖ ਸਕਦੇ ਹਾਂ ਕਿ ਤੁਹਾਡਾ ਇਸ ਟੀਚਿੰਗ ਲਾਈਨ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਕਿੰਨਾ ਕਲੋਜ਼ ਐਸੋਸੀਏਸ਼ਨ ਹੈਗੀ ਹੈ ਤੁਹਾਡੀ ਯੂ ਨੋ ਫੈਸੀਨੇਸ਼ਨ ਹੈਗੀ ਹੈ ਬਟ ਮੈਂ ਮੈਂ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਇੱਕ ਕੁਝ ਇਹ ਪੁੱਛਣਾ ਚਾਹਾਂਗਾ ਕਿ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਦੀ ਹੀ ਇਲੈਕਸ਼ਨ ਕਿਉਂ ਔਰ ਮੇਰਾ ਪੁੱਛਣ ਦਾ ਇਸ ਦਾ ਮਤਲਬ ਇਹ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਸਾਡੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਨੂੰ ਵਿਊਜ਼ ਨੂੰ ਪਤਾ ਚਲੇ ਕਿ ਕਿੰਨਾ ਇੰਪੋਰਟੈਂਟ ਹੈਗਾ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡਸ ਹਨ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਵਿੱਚ ਪਾਰਟਿਸਿਪੇਸ਼ਨ ਸਾਡੇ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਮੈਂਬਰਸ ਦੀ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਪਲੀਜ਼ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਦੱਸੋ ਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਸਾਰੀ ਪੋਜੀਸ਼ਨ ਦੇ ਚੋਂ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਦੀ ਇਲੈਕਸ਼ਨ ਨੂੰ ਹੀ ਕਿਉਂ ਚੁਣਿਆ ਥਿੰਕ ਆਪਣੀ ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਸੀਂ ਕਈ ਵਾਰ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਆ ਬਈ ਪੜਾਈ ਕਿੰਨੀ ਜ਼ਰੂਰੀ ਆ ਪੜਾਈ ਪੜਾਈ ਇੰਪੋਰਟੈਂਟ ਕਿੰਨੀ ਹੈ ਤੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਾਰੇ ਇੰਪੋਰਟੈਂਟਸ ਕਾ ਰੱਖਦੇ ਆ ਹਮੇਸ਼ਾ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਬਈ ਪੜਾਈ ਕਰ ਚੰਗੀ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਪੜੋ ਤੇ ਫਿਰ ਵਧੀਆ ਨੌਕਰੀ ਮਿਲੂਗੀ ਤਾਂ ਹੀ ਤਰੱਕੀ ਹੋਊਗੀ ਬਹੁਤ ਸਾਰੇ ਮਾਪੇ ਦਾਦੇ ਦਾਦੀ ਨਾਨਾ ਨਾਨੀ ਇਸ ਮੁਲਕ ਨੂੰ ਆਏ ਅਮਰੀਕਾ ਵਿੱਚ ਤਾਂ ਕਿ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਦੇ ਬੱਚੇ ਪੜ ਸਕਣ ਤੇ ਇੱਥੇ ਆ ਕੇ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਦੀ ਵਧੀਆ ਲਾਈਫ ਬਣੇ ਸੋ ਜੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਚਾਹੁੰਦੇ ਆ ਵੀ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਵਧੀਆ ਪੜ੍ਹਾਈ ਹੋਵੇ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਉਸ ਫਾਊਂਡੇਸ਼ਨ ਤੋਂ ਸ਼ੁਰੂ ਕਰਨਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਜਿੱਥੇ ਐਜੂਕੇਸ਼ਨ ਹੁੰਦੀ ਆ ਬਹੁਤ ਵਧੀਆ ਆ ਵੀ ਆਪਣੇ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਸਿੱਖ ਭਾਈਚਾਰੇ ਆ ਇਲੈਕਸ਼ਨਸ ਵਿੱਚ ਖੜੇ ਨੇ ਭਾਵੇਂ ਸਿਟੀ ਕਾਉਂਸਲ ਸੁਪਰਵਾਈਜ਼ਰਸ ਹੋਰ ਵੱਖ-ਵੱਖ ਪੋਜੀਸ਼ਨਸ ਹੈਗੇ ਨੇ ਪਰ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਆਹ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਦੀ ਪੋਜੀਸ਼ਨ ਆ ਇਹ ਕਈ ਏਰੀਆਜ਼ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਸਕਿਪ ਹੋ ਗਈ ਅਸੀਂ ਉਹ ਮੇਅਰ ਵਗੈਰਾ ਪੋਜੀਸ਼ਨ ਬਾਰੇ ਸੋਚੀ ਜਾਂਦੇ ਤੇ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਬਾਰੇ ਨਹੀਂ ਸੋਚ ਰਹੇ ਤੇ ਖਾਸ ਕਰਕੇ ਇੱਥੇ ਯੂਬਾ ਸਿਟੀ ਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਜਿੱਥੇ ਆਪਣੀ ਪੰਜਾਬੀਆਂ ਦੀ ਸਿੱਖਾਂ ਦੀ ਆਬਾਦੀ ਇੰਨੀ ਬੜੀ ਹੈਗੀ ਆ ਮੈਂ ਇੱਥੇ ਆਪ ਸਕੂਲ ਜਾ ਕੇ ਦੇਖਿਆ ਵੀ ਸਾਡੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਕਿੰਨੀ ਘੱਟ ਸਾਧਨ ਹੈ ਜੋ ਵੀ ਸਹੂਲਤਾਂ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਚਾਹੀਦੀਆਂ ਉਹ ਮਿਲ ਨਹੀਂ ਰਹੀਆਂ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਇੱਕ ਤਾਂ ਸਾਡੀ ਰੈਪਰੈਜ਼ੈਂਟੇਸ਼ਨ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੈਗੀ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਤੇ ਤੇ ਦੂਜੀ ਆਪਣਾ ਸੰਪਰਕ ਨਹੀਂ ਹੈਗਾ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਜਾਂ ਸਕੂਲਸ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਪ੍ਰਿੰਸੀਪਲਸ ਐਡਮਿਨਿਸਟ੍ਰੇਸ਼ਨ ਸੁਪਰਇੰਟੈਂਡੈਂਟ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਅਸੀਂ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਜ਼ਰੂਰ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਆ ਵੇ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਪੜ੍ਹਨਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਆ ਪਰ ਜਦੋਂ ਸਮਾਂ ਆਉਂਦਾ ਆ ਵੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਕੰਟੈਕਟ ਰੱਖੀਏ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਦੇ ਨਾਲ ਵੇ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਆਪਣੀ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਵਾਸਤੇ ਕੀ ਕਰ ਰਹੇ ਆ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਕੀ ਸਾਧਨ ਜਾਂ ਸਪੋਰਟ ਦਿੰਦੇ ਆ ਉਹ ਰਿਲੇਸ਼ਨਸ਼ਿਪ ਨਹੀਂ ਬਣੀ ਸੋ ਇਹ ਜ਼ਰੂਰੀ ਆ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਇਹ ਰਿਲੇਸ਼ਨਸ਼ਿਪ ਬਣਾਉਣੀ ਚਾਹੀਦੀ ਆ ਆਪਣੇ ਵੱਲੋਂ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਵੱਲੋਂ ਵੀ ਆਊਟਰੀਚ ਕਰਨਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਆ ਤੇ ਜਿਹੜੇ ਸਕੂਲ ਬੋਰਡ ਆ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਵੀ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਵੀ ਦੇਖੋ ਸਾਡੀ ਇੱਥੇ 15-20% ਪੰਜਾਬੀ ਪਾਪੂਲੇਸ਼ਨ ਆ ਅਸੀਂ ਇਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਕਿਉਂ ਨਹੀਂ ਆਊਟਰੀਚ ਕਰ
ਅੰਡਰਸਟੈਂਡਿੰਗ ਬਹੁਤ ਘੱਟ ਆ ਵੀ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਨੂੰ ਕਿਵੇਂ ਵਰਤੀ ਦਾ ਕਿਵੇਂ ਬੈਸਟ ਯੂਜ਼ ਕਰਨਾ ਹਾਂਜੀ ਜਰੂਰ ਅਸੀਂ ਫੋਨ ਚਲਾ ਲੈਂਦੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਕੰਪਿਊਟਰ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਟ ਵਰਤ ਲੈਂਦੇ ਆ ਪਰ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਉਹ ਡੂੰਗੀ ਅੰਡਰਸਟੈਂਡਿੰਗ ਹੈਗੀ ਉਹ ਡੂੰਗੀ ਸਮਝ ਆ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਦੀ ਉਹ ਲੈਕਿੰਗ ਆ ਖਾਸ ਕਰਕੇ ਸਕੂਲ ਡਿਸਟ੍ਰਿਕਟ ਤੋਂ ਹੁਣ ਜਦੋਂ ਸਾਰੇ ਬੱਚੇ ਘਰ ਬਹਿ ਕੇ Zoom ਤੇ ਕਲਾਸਿਸ ਲਾ ਰਹੇ ਆ ਪਹਿਲਾਂ ਤਾਂ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਨਹੀਂ ਪਤਾ ਵੀ ਅਸੀਂ Zoom ਕਿਵੇਂ ਵਰਤਣੀ ਆ ਕਈ ਟੀਚਰਸ ਨੂੰ ਨਹੀਂ ਪਤਾ ਵੀ ਅਸੀਂ Zoom ਇਹ ਸਟਾਰਟ ਕਿੱਦਾਂ ਕਰਨੀ ਆ ਇਹਦੇ ਵਿੱਚ ਫੀਚਰਸ ਕੀ ਹਨ ਤੇ ਸਪੈਸ਼ਲੀ ਪੇਰੈਂਟਸ ਨੂੰ ਵੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਪਤਾ ਵੀ ਇਹ ਇਹ ਚੀਜ਼ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਅਸੀਂ ਇਹਦਾ ਸਿਸਟਮ ਕੀ ਹੈਗਾ ਪ੍ਰੋਸੈਸ ਕੀ ਹੈਗਾ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਲੀਡਰਸ਼ਿਪ ਆ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਆਪਣੀ ਅੰਡਰਸਟੈਂਡਿੰਗ ਵੀ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਕਿੱਦਾਂ ਵਰਤੀ ਹੋ ਜਾਂਦੀ ਆ ਤੇ ਮੇਰਾ ਬੈਕਗ੍ਰਾਉਂਡ ਸਾਇੰਸ ਐਂਡ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਵਿੱਚ ਹੈ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਮੈਂ ਫਿਜ਼ਿਕਸ ਪੜ੍ਹੀ ਆ ਕਾਲਜ ਵਿੱਚ ਅਤੇ ਮੈਂ ਜਦੋਂ ਹਾਈ ਸਕੂਲ ਟੀਚਰ ਸੀ ਉਦੋਂ ਵੀ ਮੈਂ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਦੀ ਕਲਾਸ ਪੜਾਉਂਦਾ ਸੀ ਸੋ ਮੈਨੂੰ ਉਹ ਅੰਡਰਸਟੈਂਡਿੰਗ ਹੈ ਵੀ ਕਲਾਸਰੂਮ ਵਿੱਚ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਅਸੀਂ ਕਿਵੇਂ ਵਰਤੀ ਦੀ ਤੇ ਇਦਾਂ ਹੁੰਦਾ ਹੈ ਵੀ ਜਦੋਂ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਟੀਚਰਸ ਨੂੰ ਕਹਿੰਦੇ ਵੀ ਤੁਸੀਂ Zoom ਰਾਹੀਂ ਕਲਾਸਿਸ ਕਰਨੀ ਆ ਅਸੀਂ ਸਿਰਫ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਇੱਕ ਵਾਰੀ ਟ੍ਰੇਨਿੰਗ ਨਹੀਂ ਦੇ ਸਕਦੇ ਵੀ ਇਦਾਂ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਕਲਾਸਿਸ ਕਰਨੀ ਆ ਤੇ ਬਸ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਜਿੱਦਾਂ ਵੀ ਚੱਲਦਾ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਚਲਾਈ ਜਾਓ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਕੰਸਿਸਟੈਂਟਲੀ ਆਮ ਹਮੇਸ਼ਾ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਦੀ ਸਪੋਰਟ ਕਰਨੀ ਪੈਂਦੀ ਆ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਸਹਿਯੋਗ ਦੇਣਾ ਪੈਂਦਾ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਚੇਂਜ ਹੁੰਦੀ ਰਹਿੰਦੀ ਆ ਉਹ ਇੱਕ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਫਿਕਸਡ ਨਹੀਂ ਰਹਿੰਦੀ ਸੋ ਜਿਸ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਚੇਂਜ ਹੁੰਦੀ ਆ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਦੁਬਾਰਾ ਟ੍ਰੇਨਿੰਗ ਦੇਣੀ ਪੈਂਦੀ ਆ ਕਈ ਕੁਐਸਚਨਸ ਜਾਂ ਸਮੱਸਿਆ ਆਉਂਦੇ ਆ ਟੀਚਰਸ ਨੂੰ ਉਹ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਫਿਕਸ ਕਰਨੇ ਪੈਂਦੇ ਆ ਤੇ ਪੇਰੈਂਟਸ ਨੂੰ ਵੀ ਦੱਸਣਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਵੀ ਦੇਖੋ ਆ ਹੁਣ ਸਮਾਂ ਆ ਜਿੱਥੇ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਬੱਚੇ ਘਰ ਬਹਿ ਕੇ ਸਕੂਲ ਪੜ ਰਹੇ ਆ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਇਹਨਾਂ ਦੀ ਮਦਦ ਕਿਵੇਂ ਕਰ ਸਕਦੇ ਆ ਇਹ ਟੈਕਨੋਲੋਜੀ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਲੋਡ ਕੀਆ ਬੱਚਿਆਂ ਨੂੰ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਜੇ ਲੈਪਟਾਪ ਲੈਣਾ ਪੈਣਾ ਆ ਜਾਂ ਤੁਹਾਡੀ ਇੰਟਰਨੈਟ ਕਿਸ ਤਰ੍ਹਾਂ ਚੱਲਦੀ ਆ ਉਹ ਐਗਜ਼ੈਕਟਲੀ ਜਿਹੜਾ ਡੀਟੇਲ ਵਿੱਚ ਸਮਝਾਉਣਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਆ ਉਹ ਕਰਨਾ ਚਾਹੀਦਾ ਕਿਉਂਕਿ ਇੱਥੇ ਅਸੀਂ ਦੇਖਿਆ ਵੀ ਕੋਈ ਵੀ ਪੇਰੈਂਟਸ ਨੂੰ ਗਾਈਡਲਾਈਨਸ ਜਾਂ ਅੰਡਰਸਟੈਂਡਿੰਗ ਦਿੱਤੀ ਨਹੀਂ ਗਈ ਸੋ ਇਹ ਜਿਹੜੀ ਕਮਿਊਨੀਕੇਸ਼ਨ ਉਹ ਇੰਪੋਰਟੈਂਟ ਆ ਹਰਜੀਤ ਜੀ ਇਹ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਬਹੁਤ ਇੰਪੋਰਟੈਂਟ ਫੈਕਟਰ ਪੁਆਇੰਟ ਆਊਟ ਕੀਤਾ ਹੈ ਔਰ ਮੈਂ ਇਹ ਉਮੀਦ ਕਰਦਾ ਕਿ ਸਾਡੇ ਵਿਊਅਰਸ ਨੇ ਤੁਹਾਡੀ ਗੱਲ ਬੜੀ ਕਲੋਜ਼ਲੀ ਸੁਣੀ ਹੋਣੀ ਔਰ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੇ ਇਹ ਫੀਲ ਕੀਤਾ ਹੋਣਾ ਕਿ ਕਿੰਨਾ ਇੰਪੋਰਟੈਂਟ ਹੈ ਤੁਹਾਡੇ ਜੇ ਇੱਕ ਬੰਦੇ ਦਾ ਇਸ ਬੋਰਡ ਵਿੱਚ ਇਸ ਪੋਜੀਸ਼ਨ ਵਿੱਚ ਹੋਣਾ ਜਿੱਥੇ ਉਹ ਇੱਕ ਕਨੈਕਟ ਫੀਲ ਕਰ ਸਕਣ ਔਰ ਅਗਰ ਉਹ ਉਨ ਚੀਜ਼ਾਂ ਤੋਂ ਡਿਪਰਾਈਵਡ ਹਨ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਚੀਜ਼ਾਂ ਦਾ ਨਹੀਂ ਪਤਾ ਐਟ ਲੀਸਟ ਉਹਨਾਂ ਨੂੰ ਪਤਾ ਹੈ ਕਿ ਕਿੱਥੇ ਆਪਾਂ ਪਹੁੰਚ ਕਰ ਸਕਦੇ ਹਾਂ ਔਰ ਸਾਨੂੰ ਉਸ ਚੀਜ਼ ਦੇ ਬਾਰੇ ਪਤਾ ਚੱਲ ਸਕਦਾ ਹੈ ਅਸੀਂ ਉਸ ਦਾ ਫਾਇਦਾ ਚੱਕ ਸਕਦੇ ਹਾਂ ਮੈਂ ਤੁਹਾਨੂੰ ਪਰਸਨਲੀ ਥੈਂਕ ਕਹਿੰਦਾ ਕਿ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਇਸ ਯੰਗ ਏਜ ਵਿੱਚ ਸਾਹਮਣੇ ਆ ਕੇ ਇਹ ਤੁਸੀਂ ਇਹ ਸਟੈਪ ਲੈਂਦੇ ਪਏ ਹੋ ਇਹ ਇੱਕ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ ਦੀ ਬਹੁਤ ਵੱਡੀ ਹੈਲਪ ਹੈ ਯੂ ਆਰ ਬਿਲਡਿੰਗ ਬ੍ਰਿਜਸ ਫॉर ਦ ਕਮਿਊਨਿਟੀ thank you Chief. very much and thank you very much for coming today and speaking with us we wish you Chief. all the very best for your campaign thank you ji te bahut bahut dhanwad te beinti karda ha jehde vi srote sun rahe ha tusi please